Priceless ruins from Sydney's colonial past have been uncovered during excavation work to build the North West Rail Link. Among the incredible finds, foundations of an old inn and a coin that is almost 200 years old. This is a dig with a difference. Right next to Windsor Road, Kellyville, a slice of Sydney nearly two centuries ago. Well, the archaeological evidence is indicating to us that this was quite a substantial building. Um, very deep sandstone footings, a two-storey building. In fact, it was the White Hart Inn built around 1830 and historians believe it would have looked like this. The inn would have been the home um, to so many stories um, of people going to their farms um, to start a new life uh, in the colony and, and further out. Um, and people coming back with tales of the bushrangers and the Aboriginal people that they would have met along the way. Among the treasures unearthed in recent weeks, a coin stamped 1816 with a Roman likeness of King George III. Another coin is stamped 1853. There's also a tub of cherry-flavoured toothpaste complete with an image of Queen Victoria. The leg from a ceramic doll, plus an iron key. I'm standing in what archaeologists believe is the cellar for the White Hart Inn. Now, the original plan was to have an enormous pillar right here for the Skytrain section of the North West Rail. But all of this will now be preserved. The quietness that would have been here, we, we wouldn't have heard the cars, the horses would have been in the stables, and, and you begin to see how isolated this area was. What happened to the inn is a mystery. It was put on the market in 1881 and stopped trading early last century. This was a discovery we didn't expect to make. It's a piece of history we didn't expect to find, but I'm really pleased that we will be able to preserve it for future generations to witness and enjoy. There will be a public open day on Saturday, April 5. Places are limited and bookings must be made. Go to northwestrail.com.au for more details. Kevin Wilde, Nine News.